Hey there, parents. Talking to your teen about sex can feel like navigating a minefield, right? But don't worry, I've got some essential tips to help you out. Let's dive in. First off, what is sex education, really? It's not just the birds and the bees talk. It's about giving your teen the information, motivation and skills they need to make healthy decisions about their sexual health. We're talking about everything from understanding relationships to managing their own sexual health. Now, why is sex education so crucial for teenagers? Well, it helps them make informed choices, reduces the risk of unwanted pregnancies and prevents sexually transmitted diseases. Plus, it equips them with the values they need for healthy relationships. So how do you break the ice? First, uh, prepare yourself. Talk to your partner, decide on the messages and values you want to communicate and keep yourself updated on current issues. Maybe even find a good book on sexual development to read with your teen. Next, consider your teen's point of view. Listen carefully and never discourage them. Understand their concerns and pressures. Be direct and honest. Share your feelings about sex-related issues openly and objectively. Talk about the risks like sexually transmitted diseases and unplanned pregnancies. Invite more discussion. Encourage your teen to come to you with their questions or doubts. Always welcome their questions and reassure them that you're happy they came to you. Let's talk about some do's and don'ts. Make yourself available. Be approachable and create a comfort zone for your child. The best way to be a good sex educator is to be someone they feel comfortable talking to. Keep it casual, so don't make sex sound complicated. Make it easier for them to understand. Keep eye contact while talking. Avoiding eye contact can suggest you're embarrassed or uncomfortable. If your child senses your discomfort, they might think talking about sexual issues is a taboo. Remember, sex education is more than just sex. It's about teaching values like compassion and responsibility. Explain how these values apply to all aspects of life, including sexual decision. And here are some don'ts. Don't use pet names for private part. It can create a sense of shame about their bodies. Use the correct names to help them feel comfortable with their own bodies. You don't back out of uncomfortable talk either. If your child approaches you, don't change the subject. Uh, admit if you're nervous, but do your best to answer their questions. And lastly, don't criticize or get angry. Stay calm and supportive. Your goal is to create an open, honest dialogue with your teen. That's it for today, parents. Remember, Talking to your teen about sex doesn't have to be daunting. With these tips, you can create a safe, open space for your teen to learn and grow. Thanks for watching.